Hi honeys, it's Michelle. I'm here today to do a Stitch Fix unboxing. And I am in drastic need of loungewear. I'm sure I'm not alone. <laughs> I've been watching so many um, clothing box videos of people asking for loungewear. And I've noticed that most of the time what they get are dry clean only silk shirts or blouses and dresses, but not the kind you'd wear at home. Um, slacks, jeans, all kinds of stuff that you would never wear at home. And I'm thinking, do they realize that we have pets? We have kids, not me, but you know, most people. We cook, we do um, chores around the house. We snuggle up on the couch and, you know, watch movies and eat popcorn and we're not Kardashians. We're, we're regular people that um, don't have housekeepers and maids and um, other people doing our laundry for us. <laughs> so with that in mind, I asked for a loungewear box and I trust that my stylist sent me loungewear, but like actual loungewear? We'll see. I mean, I hope she did. I trust her, but I'm a little worried because I've seen so many misses on the subject. <laughs> Uh, but because I'm doing a loungewear video, I wanted to go ahead and wear what I wear when I'm lounging at home, which is uh, no makeup with just a little bit of lip gloss on, nothing fancy, a, a bralette or a sports bra, and then my hair is usually in pigtails or braids or a bun or something like that. So that's why I am a little underdressed and under makeup today. Um, this is the realistic look of how I look at home when I'm not filming. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and open the box. I do also want to tell you, I'm probably not really going to bother explaining the box. I've done so many of these videos. I feel like you know what they are now. If you don't know what Stitch Fix is or how it works, you're welcome to watch my last Stitch Fix video or the one before that or the one before that. But I'm just going to kind of dive right into it. So here's the box. Go ahead and open it here. I'm not going to read what my stylist said to you or anything right now. I'm just going to dive right in. Appears to be a sweater of some sort. brand is Pink Clover in a 1X made in China. It's the Chaya Double Pocket Open Cardigan in Burgundy. It's 75% acrylic, 20% polyester, 5% spandex. Dry clean only. <laughs> and it's got a little bit of like a Oh, what do you call that? Like a dark edging around the edge. Okay, so that's the first item. Just put this on my thread here. Here's the rest of the bundle. Ooh, this is one of those super soft sweatshirts or sweaters. Uh, Market and Spruce. I love Market and Spruce. I think Market and Spruce is Stitch Fix's brand. I also love Olive Green. It's really soft. Uh, it's the Paulson Brush Knit Top in Olive in a 1X made in China. It looks like it's either got three quarter sleeves or those sleeves that go just above the elbow. So let's see. 
78% rayon, 18% polyester, 4% spandex. Machine wash. All right. Okay, and then this one is, oh, this is the same top, okay, but in like a darker purple color. It's really soft, though. We'll see how it, how it fits what we think. Then there is Letty and Me Lynn Pullover Light Gray 1X. It's made in China. Here's what that one looks like. This is more like a regular sweater. It's cute. I will admit I would never wear this at home, though. 79% rayon, 21% polyester machine wash. Okay, the reason I wouldn't wear this at home is I have black cats. Um, <laughs> and I usually don't wear things quite this nice at home because I'd worry about um, when I'm cooking, getting food splashed on it, or when I'm cleaning, getting stuff splashed on it, that kind of thing. The first, or the last two, though, I would definitely wear at home. Oh, that was nice of him. Our breakfast is here. <laughs> um, the cardigan I probably wouldn't wear at home either, but I, I will explain all this in a little bit. And then the, the last thing is, looks like some pants. They're leggings, active leggings. Lola gets Ashton High Rise Boot Cut Legging Black in a 1X. Okay, boot cut works for me. I was going to say, I hope these aren't straight leg. I don't like straight leg. <laughs> um, well, made in the USA. All right. They look like they're going to be tight, but then again, that might be okay, right? I might look a little bit smaller in them. 88% <laughs> polyester, 12% spandex, turn garment inside out, machine wash cold. Okay. I have the first outfit on here. Now I do like this top. I think it's very cute. I just don't know that I would wear it at home, but I like the way it fits. And it is very cozy. After I've tried on all the tops, I will move you down a little bit so you can get a an up close view of these bottoms too. Here is the second outfit. Now this goes down, if I pull it down all the way, it goes down to here, which is just under the, you know, like the saddlebag area. So that's kind of nice. It can cover up a little bit. I don't feel too revealed if I have um, you know, the cable guy coming by or something like that. It's very soft. I like the way it fits. I like the way it feels. I love the color. It is three-quarter length sleeves. I don't mind so much on this. I usually hate three-quarter length sleeves, but I don't mind so much on this because at home, um, I kind of like cozy tops, you know, that are three-quarter length. So if I'm doing the dishes or something, I don't have to deal with the constant sleeve falling in the water kind of thing. Okay, now I have the cardigan on over this last top. It's got pockets. I like it. It's nice and long. It's cozy. It's like soft, but it's kind of scratchy too. It's very warm. The sleeve length is nice and long. I like the edging, how it's the darker color. And here's the olive green color top. What do you think? I can't wait to hear. <laughs> okay, and then I wanted to show you these bottoms here. They are high rise. Now, usually these high-rise pants 
will fall down. These have stayed up the whole time, which is great. There's no pockets. They're very cozy though. And I like that if I wanted to, I could work out in them as well. I do want to, I just can't. <laughs> and when I'm able to work out again, I could work out in these bottoms. I can't work out at the gym right now. I had a discussion with my doctor about it and because I have asthma, she does not want me to work out with a mask on, <laughs> which Especially, she said, when somebody's out of shape and you're gasping for air more than usual anyway, then you add a mask onto it and asthma. She said it's a recipe for disaster. I tend to agree with her. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, I'm happy with the box. But I'm kind of sad because I just looked at my note. And I have a different stylist. What happened to my other stylist? Amber, where'd you go? Um, so this lady's name is Anne, and um, I do like what Anne picked out. I Thank you, Anne. I'm just surprised that my um, stylist changed. But one thing that's really nice about what she sent is everything can be worn at home, but it can also be worn out of the house, which I genuinely like. They don't actually look like pajamas, per se. Um, so here's the style card that came along with the box. Okay, these high rise boot cut leggings that I'm wearing are uh, $72. They're very comfortable and they're very cute. That is way out of my price range though. And I know that's not a bad price for active wear, but like I just said, I can't go to the gym right now. So it's kind of kind of a little too much for me, uh, just to be honest. Um, and then this, uh, this top I have on the olive top, it's, it's $40. That's not bad. Um, and then I have another, this purple colored one. So that's also $40. Then we've got the sweater that I tried on. That is 58. And then, sorry, it's inside out, but the striped top I tried on, that one is 44. So aside from the boot cut uh, leggings, I think the prices on these aren't bad. Um, you know, I, I prefer 50 or less per item. Uh, the total stylus pick or the, the subtotal for everything would be $254. If I kept everything, the discount would be $63.50, um, bringing it down to $190.50. So let me know what you think. What would you keep if you were me? Um, I'm leaning towards the, I like these two tops, and I like the striped top. Um, Brad did not like the cardigan on me, so that one's just automatically out. And then the, the leggings, as much as I like them, um, I don't like the price, so I'm out on those two. <laughs> but otherwise, uh, let me know what you think of the other three tops. Would you keep all three? Would you not keep any of them? Let me know. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you have a wonderful, glorious rest of your day. And I hope you're enjoying your holiday season. I love you. Bye.